Hello, what's up my good people? It's you Galji, the Dope Storyteller, again with a very interesting video. And I am so glad to be back. And before I continue or commence with this video, I would really love to appreciate the people who watch my content. Like, I am so, so happy. I appreciate you. I love you. I, I don't know. Like, I don't know how I can pay you back. But thank you. Thank you so much. Um... If this is your first time that you're watching my videos, kindly take a minute, actually five seconds are enough for you to go back and subscribe to my YouTube channel, ring that notification bell so that every time I post a new video, you are among the first people to be notified. Oh, sorry. The first people to be notified. So I'm just so, so happy uh, that we're still going. I know it's a journey. Uh, I've come from far. I've not yet uh, gotten to where I want, but it's a process. So pole pole, then I am sure I'm going to make it there. So that being said, let's get into our today's video. So today I was just um, feeling like I should um, just and talk about the things that have been happening throughout the week. Um, most of the time, some of us don't have the time to uh, go via the social media, I'm a listen to gossip or things like that. You know, alafu, kama ni kitu yumepostiwa kwa Instagram, after a while, in a pita, like, it's past. It's not easy for you to access it. Like, kama ilipostiwa asubui na maybe wamo kuingia Instagram jioni, then yo kitu ilipostiwa asubui, unaweza kosa kuyona. See? Uh, on... Twitter, one thing is trending this minute and the next is something different. So that is how it just works. Same as Facebook. Your updates are easy and then mtu wakingia badai atapata the new updates. Atapata zile za kitambo zime zilikuwa zime zime postiwa na wadau. So today I just wanna talk about the things that have been happening throughout this week given that to begin with wanafunzi wamefunga shule, they're at home. So be ready for saksa. Ama this generation is on another note, like they're enlightened. I want to come here, saksa, X, A, X, A, mambuza. You know, those things used to annoy me, but uh, tunasonga mbele, right? Yeah, so today I want to talk about, uh, okay, I already said what I'm talking about today, gosh. Okay, let's begin with um, TikTok. There's this lady, Anaitua. Grace Africa. What? She set up a greet and meet and no one showed up. What does that say you people? <laughs> For me, a TikTok ni kama siri. Like, uneza kuko na followers, uneza kuko na likes, views, but what? You're not known to nobody. Like, if they know you there on TikTok, but it come kwa ground, Eh, things in are quite different. Anyways, yeah, that's that for you. Like, you organize an event and then unambia watu, I'll be here, time fulani, so you can come, see me, say hi, I might even give you gifts, but unfortunately, nobody shows up. What? Uh, she ended up calling her mom, like Grace Odeme. She called her mom, akamambia how it was. Yeah, my mom ni kama neza niambia niende home to galie pamoja. That is kind of humiliating. Na sijui kama alikuwa na jua where she stand. Like, unajua sometimes it's good to know you. Uh, should I say level? Like, pali uko with people. Are you on the same page? Get. Yeah. Talking about that, events. There's also Marilinda. Um, kona boyfriend and I try to Na they post videos of each other pale TikTok. But how kidogo, they have come out like, see, maseleb wa TikTok peke yake. Kidogo, kidogo, wana grow. So, within the week, um, Mwende, Mwende Masharia, wa Radio Maisha, right? Ya, yeah. alikuwa me, wa host, kwa radio station yao, and, Merilinda said that, like, alitua tu, your statement, Alisema your statement that currently she's the most 
hated TikTok. Most hated. Why would you guys give so much hate to somebody back and I feel any way TikTok yote ni mindo ule mse hated. A moment for her. Now, eh, kama umjiu neza msacha, anaitua Melinda na bwane yake anaitua is it Rafu Clint? Ama ni Clint? Something, yeah. Now, Mary amekuwa akitukanu wa like too much. Uh, Moso by a, a person called Exotic Peaches. Alikama kasi. Ame mtukanu like I cannot even say those things. Here are the bad. Bad like ni mbaya. Because anasema uh, Mary blocked her and other friends after she invited them to an event like see like we invite like na kupatia card you know ile uh, you just notify people like i'll be having this event and i would love you to come and she fini 1000 yes that is what mary did and then nikama see nikama definitely these friends are the people that alidhani new friends from tiktok they never showed up and then akawa block so after kuwa block no story yote inatokea hapo. So, what guys? What is not happening? I know we have so much on our plates, like with the economy, crisis and everything. Kutua 1,000 and nyewe si mchezo juwe. Miyato yo 1,000 si na. Labda, nicheka namba yangu mune changie. Niku bad. Enyewe niku bad. So, if you're having an, an event, it's being paid for. Usi expect watu wengi, unless wenye wako na mazo. Yeah, na watu wenye wako na mazo, wanaiza DP events, wakam, but watu wengine, uh, ita kuwa tricky. Alright, that's um, kidogo from TikTok. That is what I've been able to come with. Enye, like, ni enticing motion, enticing ya TikTok. Alright, now, Let's talk about our girl, our Kamba girl. Hey, mini Kamba with you. <laughs> our Kamba girl, Ambare. Ambare, I'm um, She has been in a relationship with uh, a man, this tycoon. Okay, yeah. Manamujua. Jamal, 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 whatever. Now, uh, they've been married. Married. Okay, wamekua in that relationship again with another lady. Like, what? Inyewe, <laughs> kueleza vitu ni ngumu. <laughs> Anyways, uh, wamekua mabibi wa wili. There were two wives. There is Amira and there is Amber. So, Amira, Amira, huh? okay, claims that um, Ambare alienda ku, kutafuta sanuake and taking photos and things like that. And then, Whew. Okay, let me just read what uh, Adisema. Mm? Uh, can someone tell Ambare next time uh, she comes to Yamin San Nam, uh, to keep her boundaries? When I was away for the weekend, she kept calling my son Shamir, who was playing in the estate, to come take a photo with her. Shamir, ha, lady, I don't know. Yeah, we took a maze so Amber ni nani. Hmm? Do you all know Amber Ray? So Amber came back with um come back, you know, yeah. And then she said, the way you all desperate for fame really sickens me. Yaani, for someone to be relevant in this Kenya Lazima, you mentioned my name. Sio Conman, sio Wazimu, eti wengine I wanted to take pics with your son. For who? For what? I'm shocked that your kids can lie that, that much, but again, they have your blood. Kai, 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 this is bad. Uh, ati uliachiwa jimol. Jamal, Jamal, hey, you didn't any Uh When will you ever stop lying to world? You guys still live in the same house and he is still seeing another woman on the side and you are okay with that. Aki pesa wewe ati marriage. Oh, tumeto kambali. Anyway, the bottom line is I left him for you and you still couldn't have him. And please, next time, Next time you want to be relevant, give me a call. I know you sh you still 
have my number. If not, ask your husband to give you my number. I can post you as an ad on my page. Hehehe. Wee, wee, Na back off. Hmm? Na check a minute. So what do you guys think about um these things? Like, e kurushiana maneno ya from uh, one person to another. Like, these people were um at one time a couple and now they're not. So, since vitu aziendi vizuri, watu wananza kurushiana maneno. Okay, see, at vitu aziendi vizuri, like, walisha achana, but I don't know kama ni true. Ambari says the story is not true and then there is now Amira who is coming up with another different story. Akisema Amber was looking for the children or pige picha. So, lazima tushine tumevutana, like, tusha achana, kila mtu wa maenda njazake, then why do we have to zozana? Okay, I am not saying... I am saying, but I am not insinuating anything. But here, because I am not in that situation, I have never been, and I pray that I'll never be, because see how it feels. You know, ya kuwashana na mtu, and then munashinda, like, anashinda na drag back into that mud. Ju, alipuachana na Jamal, definitely alipuachana na Amira, like, they're not in the same uh, house, they're not having this, sharing the same man, you get. Yeah, so, I think... Kama Amber has already decided to move on with her life, uh, the rest of you, like Amira, Jamal, you should just let her be. Ama guys, what you think? Hey, hey. On that note, yeah, my pensy, my pensy. Let's talk of Mid, our favorite um, Gengeton artist. Gengeton, Major. Okay, yeah, he's a nice artist. Napenda Major, Napenda Ngomaza Major. So, um, Major has been dating this lady, and it's hmm? So, nakumbuka birthday ya Major, udem ali mwambia maneno yenye haya kukua mazuri, like, it wasn't a good way to wish someone her happy birthday, ali mwambia vitu mbaya, and then, you know, don't enjoy your birthday. Okay, I cannot uh, say the exact words unless I read them, nasi na hapa, so I was just saying that, Alimwambia maneno aziko kuwa poor sana so Major again akapeana come back you know I love it when mnarushia nanga is ni mnaambia nanga one side of the story and that and then the other person decides to give their uh, side of the story so Major said that um kudem uh, alikam kwake na watoi na ali try kumpenda ngeye na watoto wake and then you know yeah anyway they still ended up uh, not being together. So, this week, Millie, Alisema, uh, uh, kwa post fulani yako, she said, I miss my man, or her man, or our man, however man it is, I miss him. <laughs> Contradicting. Mara ni wake, mara ni wa yule, mara ni wetu, hajui ni wanani, but whoever man it is, and I miss. Wah, mean kafika pa hali pa admit that I miss my ex. Eh, mungu, nyondole hiyo. But, is it about the money? Nadze, kifikia pa hali kuna pesa, well, I can think twice. Because, eh, ina depend na treatment, so liku na pewa. Ala. Ah, kwa dab. This is juicy. Wah, what do you think? Like, do you guys still miss your exes? Do you feel like I still wanna call him, but my ego? Until sometimes it gets to a, it gets to a point where you lower your gas and. Unamwambia, lakini who you are kumwambia? She went public. Hey, imi nambia wazau wazau wa Kenya, fellow Kenyans. I miss my ex. Hey, <laughs> wow. Anyway, that has been too much of. Uh, Bad news. I wish I had good news. Kamoza. Ka good news. Kamoza ni kwamba. You all know Caroline Mutoko. She's a. Is it. Um, ni news anchor. Apana litoka. Okay. Whatever thing she is. <laughs> all I know is that uh, this week. She bought land for her two kids. Hey. Kila moza. Kona title deeds title zids 
I am here. Um, the main year, my late twenties. And what do I have? Niko na nini? Apart from the mokubo ya kuwa chekea hapa na kuwapigia kelele. Anyways, well, uh, it's good um, to secure your kid's future. I I also know that if my parents were in the same place, pia mi wange ni baya land, ama wange grab ya mtu wa nipati. Okay, I'm crazy. Okay. Yeah, but, where? I'm not to a double, like, I think, Anyway, kuna manya mafika 18, sujui, but uh, below that. Whew. We should invest in ourselves and in our children. You feel me? Yeah. Um, to song mbele. You all know your favorite t uh, radio presenters, Kamene Goro and Oga Obina, the Kenyan Oga Obina. Yeah, they have been uh, nominated for AMTA awards. I am wishing them all the best. Now, I love you guys. Do you? By the way, guys, what is your favorite? Uh, no, I shouldn't say radio station. I shouldn't. I don't want to say show. Um, let's talk of what your favorite radio presenters. Ah, uh, kama ni duo, kama ni moja. Niambie, let me know, let me know, let me know your favorite. Um, uh, TV, TV, uh, nini, no, no, sorry, not a type TV. Radio present, aki gai. Ule, ni bukani metu pambao kidogo, sorry. Ha, na u, watu wenye ni waze kama mimi, uh, we all recognize a lady by the name Conjestina. Achieng. <laughs> Anyways, don't mind me. Congestina Achieng. So Conge was um an award winning Kenyan boxer. Like boxer. I'm like okay. What? Yeah, this one. Boxer. But um currently Things have turned out different. There's a time nilikuwa nime muona kwa was it what TV was that? Ama ilikuwa kwa Sonko live, Mike Sonko. Yeah, Mike Sonko. And alikuwa menda kumvisit some place in Mombasa. She was in a rehab. Alikuwa napata medication hapo. And I hoped that and get her out of that place akikuwa fiti akikuwa poor and maybe she would have gotten back to what she was doing or something different but something that would have been constructive but i don't know what happened after the talk hapo but the thing is i think she's still in the streets uh i read a story this week about that um sanwake and a big that um People take, okay, people, or go, the government, I don't know, but uh, some well-wishers should just come to rescue his mom, Sababu. Uh, she turned down an offer, likuwa aende maju. Sujui ni kustadi ama ni kufanya nini, but he was to go to maju, but he didn't because he really needs to take care of his mother. So, yeah, what am Drug addiction is real. Whichever substance that you're taking out there, the drug of your choice out there, can you take it with limit, like responsibly? Let me say that. Sababu, when you become, when you become an addict, things get tough. For you, for your family, for your relatives, for your friends, even for the society. Um, and kujilipia rehab, it's not easy, like, it's expensive, I'm not gonna lie, I have had friends who've been there, it's not easy, so, as I said before, let's take whatever we're taking responsibly, najua ni pesa, responsibly, what, sorry, najua ni pesa yako, najua ni, 
starehe yako and nobody is supposed to dictate how you going to enjoy your life ama live it but ikifikia pahali where you cannot um fend for yourself like hata kujibaia food kufanya the the, the, the minor okay the, they're not minor but the major things like the you need zile zako za muhimu zile important you can sasa hiyo it's problematic and i am not saying that it is bad no addiction is a disease guy nimeanza ku sound kama mimi ni psychologist ama <laughs> yeah, counselor no i'm not but i am just saying yeah nilisha wapatanga disclaimer in my other videos i just talk about these things um in my own perspective ama vile tu nimesoma vile tu nimeelewa from uh, the society the way marafiki zangu wamenielezea whatever they have been going through you see yeah that is how i wapatia yeah, the way i give back this information to you so yeah i am not saying that i am a counselor or anything but yeah you should check out look out for your friends um advise them ukiona they are overdoing whatever thing that they are doing kama ni mira kama ni bangi kama ni pombe kama ni cocaine heroin some some of the things these things tunaonanga ni kama uh, they are not uh, available but trust me you mtu anazitumia they know how to get them and they prefer I'd rather not eat than miss this drug of my choice so that being said what do you think like nani atapa anapaswa kuingililia kati to help uh congestina because well she really needs help with a million uh, okay a million a thousand oh, okay a number of others out there who are in the same situation mtu amekuwa fit there is also another is alikuwa ni wa GSU ama ni wa KDF a guy mwenye alikuwa na um, okay maybe you've not come across this but i have do this week nimekuwa tunikiangalia udaku <laughs> like nimekuwa ni si udaku pasi but whatever has been happening in our country yeah so there's this that guy mwenye alikuwa nimewambia sijui ni wa gani sijui ni wa GSU ama ni KDF but ako kwa streets ni addict and one of these uh, was it a blogger or what yeah alimwambia ambie serikali kitu and what he said was he's uh, remorseful for what he did he's willing to change he's willing to become a better person and ikiwezekana omchukua they take him back to the rehab they you first have to heal you first have to deal with um your addiction right and then sasa you will be able to get back to your normal state maybe and then sasa unaweza serve so amesema yeye apelekwe tu akuwe rehabilitated and then he will be glad to get back to work and maybe resume his previous life okay najua ni moroni mongele history sana kama by the ijua ah partially yes i was uh i was an alanon i don't know yeah kitu kama hiyo the people who deal okay the people who are um close to addicts unajua we we see addict but uko close na mtu mwenye ni addict so uh maybe asira zake behaviors zake kila kitu yake uh anaku 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 venti like ana leta kwako you get yeah so i have such a story maybe god willing siku moja i will air that story like nita wana right yeah maybe with the creature maybe i said maybe with the creature so yeah that's it so what down what down what down let's be responsible for our own lives because since itaka any of my friends why she a um, miserable life because of drugs right again this week okay of course whatever i'm talking about ni hii wiki <laughs> um professor hamo uh, alikuwa ameandika like he's happy like okay alikuwa ame post kamtoto nitawaonyesha mali hapa kamtoto and um 
he was happy i'm glad that alikuwa amepata a, a bundle of joy like a baby girl so people thought like a baby girl is from who is from zemu zemu tai chemu tai zemu tai zemu tai yeah okay yeah so zemu tai na yeye akakana maneno akasema sio mimi aki comedy uh sio mimi aki uh, i am not the mother of uh, professor hamos a uh, newborn baby you see uh, akasema ni maybe from the other family so anyways thanks for the congratulations she added yeah so alisema yeye si yeye but we congratulate the okay he's not the only one but he's among the new fathers in town he's a new father he's always been a father Okay whatever thing it is congratulations hamu <laughs> Now there has been this um uh show that kina Charles are bringing it's called the the is it the Charles culture ama ni nini kitu kama hiyo culture ya show marks but i know it involves betty shallow most of you have seen it kwa social media like imekuwa advert ya show marks like kila time hata ukiplay a video on youtube um me, okay hata kwa uh, instagram imekuwa hapo yeah so people are interested in their story right now like the three sisters wanataka kujua hey why did you decide to come up with this blah, 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 blah. so yeah they were also hosted in a show by i think monday mashari abad Yeah, I think so. So they were there talking about uh, Masi uh, Masi Chalo and Betty Chalo walikuwa wanaongelelea the kind of men that they date and wakasema what they said. So there has been a fake account, ni kama uh, yeah, a fake account. Yenye ilikuwa inasema Betty Chalo only dates men with cool cars like with big cool cars and alipinga hiyo maneno alisema uh -huh. don't believe everything you read on the internet we all got to work hard uh no easy way out that's the only thing i always advocate for hard work all, uh, also everyone's hustle and journey is to be celebrated we all have to start from somewhere but i understand people must create fake stories to make a, a living or just get clicks apachini cars don't impress me good day unfortunately cars impress me tenevib <laughs> why because anyways i can't talk too much mm. what do you think of that given that uh, most of the time we get to know the kind of okay not the kind the men that betty is dating we get to know kila mwanaume mwenye na date maybe inafika ngapa hali ana post si kila mwanaume some of the men hmm. because pia mimi naweza ficha wengine anyway some of the men that ana date anaweka pale kwa social media and yeah mmewaona so what do you think what what do you guys think eh let's do nikola shida gani anyways sorry mnafikiria nini it's me i think it's a choice okay my opinion eh hata nikitaka mtu mwenye ako na magari nikitaka mtu mwenye ako na you know mado peke yake if that is where i set my bar then wa kenya and the rest of the world hakuna kitu mtafanya shida ni vile sijafika hapo <laughs> ama mnataka ni wasetie bride press kama pretty pretty vishi hmm? Mimi niwambie yangu ni 4 billion. Kai, <laughs> acha kabibaya. Kai. Well, anyways. Ho, huh. nataka niwambie bright prize yangu ni how much by the way? Maka kutolewa ngapi? Mama mnataka niwambie body count kwanza ndio mnievaluate. Mavajina as I said in my previous videos. <laughs> anyways, yeah. That was a fake account mwenye mtu alikuwa anasema hivyo. Na um, 
It could fake, it could real. It's her life anyway. Yeah, it is. And anybody else out there, Munyana, feel that I should uh, swear, guy, Mkamba, I should set my back here, then do it. Ukisema wewe, you just want old men. Kindly. Pambara na the old men. Ukisema wewe, you want to vijana. To be in 10. Can you pambana as long as the creature is above 18 years and they can decide whatever they're doing is right or is for you. Pia my boys, muki decide you you want sugar mummies, you want whatever person you want. It is your choice. It is your life. And remember, we're only living once, people. So live it to the fullest. regrets. To say maybe God akupatile grace. Yeah, you don't die by accident, you don't die by mysterious things, eh? You just um Ile tu ya maybe ukuwe mgonjwa ama you get to that old age whereby oh, umezeeka sasa. And then ukiwa pale unasema like tuseme unambia watoto ama wajuku wako that I, oh by the way I wish I I did this. I didn't live life this way. He? Live life the way you want. Hmm? If kama you are a believer like me, you make sure, first of all, you please God. And then, nothing else matters. Because if you please God, definitely to please your parents, they'll be okay with the, with it. And then there, any other person, when you are fine with it, then screw them. I was just testing my fingers. Kama yeah, so that has been said. Right, what else do I have here? Moshene, Moshene, where are you? Another, no, who you not a news anchor? I know, yeah, I know she's a news anchor. Wow, citizen guy, if I'm wrong, I am going to struggle myself. <laughs> so, uh, in an interview, no, she was not being interviewed. Okay, I don't know what was happening, but. I'm talking about my fellow Kamba, uh, Lillian Muli. Wakamba za, wakamba za. Sikupongoza, wakamba. Tuiva mwe. Mwiva nesa. Onakwengi yuwa nesa. Ola, kwa ni iko nini. Sometimes it's good to speak your language. Yeah, so, she told um, a love struck fan, like mtu mwenye anataka kumuletia mapenzi. I am not single. I am not single. I am not searching. Pia mimi, I'm not single. <laughs> but then, wadu tukiego, tunarudi soko. Tunarudi soko. Tunarudi gani? Juvi tungu, tunalia, tutalia lia bure, ama tuta, okay, whatever. Tutakua, tutaoza, whatever. Eh, avocado, tutafinywa, finywa, na wata nunua. Tumato, tutaribika, tu. Kai! Sielewi. Sugar cane, watachukua, kutafude, wateme. Side ni gun. Side ni gun. Hmm. Ata ya apple sinaribika. So. I don't know which side we are going. Ju sisi wate. Tukirudi soko. Ni second hand. Mutumba. Kai. Anyways. I am just joking. So. Yeah. Just so you know. Lillian Molly is off the market. Okay. Yes. By the way. Uh, speaking of Lillian Muli, the ex to my Machakos governor, um, Lillian Nganga, eh, Tongrele Lillians, Lillian Nganga, um, Buwana Yake, Buwana Yake, yes, Giuliani said that uh, he knows how to, to cook ch chapos, and that is, okay, he said it sarcastically, I'm not saying like Alice Maki Kwa serious. He has a trick into cooking nice, soft, nice chapels that Zena Zena hold. Uh, okay, and he thinks that is what is holding his relationship together. What is holding your relationship? What? Mine is my big mouth. Ha! Ha! My big mouth. <laughs> what is holding your relationship together? Anyways, um, maybe what do you think of that couple? 
anyway, you don't have to think nothing. You're not commenting about that. You're not going to think about nothing because it's a couple that God has brought together. Who are you to separate them? Who are you <laughs> to say anything against them? Anyways, uh, now let's talk about my two favorite beings. Okay, two favorite. Okay, the people I just like in the social media. I'm talking about uh, Morogi Muni. M U N Y I. Okay. Morogi Muni. Yes. And Huda Monroe. You guys all know Huda. Huda. By the way, I've had a question. Okay. I think I know the answer. Hmm. There is this lady. Oh, gosh, what am I saying? Uh, Murugi Muni has been the yummy mommy. Am I right? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think I'm right. So, as you all know, okay, if you don't know now, let me uh, inform you that uh, Huda is selling products that she claims, I have not tested them, she claims they tighten the pussy, <laughs> your kasusu, the vagina. All right. Yeah, so that is what uh, she claims. I, 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 she also says that um, her products. Okay, you all know that is it. That what that is in an epigia kerele, but it's okay. Hmm. Where were we? Na po yangu Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, Genevieve, you crazy. Okay. So yeah, in a in a in a in a in a funny, um, your vagina to smell so well, um, in a tighten, in a it helps the vagina also in its self cleaning mechanism or method whatever. Yeah, but okay. By the way, guys, I have also made a video about that, about uh, what, what like ways to make you, your coochie smell nice. And be healthy, like ile uh, natural, ile vituzile normal that you're supposed to do. Yeah, but he ni ahuda, so yo ni video yangu ni nilifanya my own opinions and some of the things, uh, some of the things ni researched. Eh? Yeah. So come over watch your video kindly. You can also watch that unaiza saidika, and then yeah, back to this story. So that is what the product that. Uh, Huda is selling and according to what I read, uh, I think Murugi got to test like Akaitumia that product. Yoya Huda Sasa. You get? So after she used the product, maybe okay, not maybe, but it's just so them straight. That after Ameitumia, Ilimpatia a lot of red flags. Actually, she used that word. Like, the product is giving her a lot of red flags. So, you know, that's bad for market. Like, for Huda, that's bad. And I can say, like, Murugi ni kama anaharibu market. But it's also good to say, kama something eja kubamba. Sema, maybe you get to help someone else out there. Aji hadari in advance. Aji, if I'm buying this product... Ineza ni patia these and these products because most of these products as you patiangi side effect, you know, yeah. And then we all know those are chemicals, so you are using chemical, you are inserting chemicals. Okay, so you come in insertion, amania applying amani pills that you take, but whatever thing it is, the chemicals that you are giving to your body, and then it's a very sensitive area. We're talking about the vagina. We're not just talking about at the palm of your aunt, ama your hair. Hair is a mongika and then hopefully to number una utame ingine. You get. But this is you. VJ, you're talking about. So, yeah. So, Murugi Muni aka sema um, experience yake with this product. Something that Huda didn't take so lightly. So, uh, here, Nikona um, a what? I have a, a response of Murugi Munyi after Huda said something mean. Eh? Okay. Hmm. Uh, there's a lot going on on 
uh, going on online right now but let me just say uh to whoever is out there fat shaming fellow women i want you to know that you're beautiful and you are loved and whatever is inside you that makes you feel like you want to insult someone who does not look like you i honestly hope uh that um yeah, that's resolved because that's an ugly and hor horrible way to go through life that is what murogi says hmm. because huda had said something relentless about uh, murogi muni's weight which i kind of like uh, the same way you abuse my brand is the same way i will insult you go get a go get a life no physical surgery can help your stinky stinking mental attitude look within my business is like my baby insulting it is like insulting my child you don't know how long and how much hard work has been put to bring us to where we are yet you sit in your old old mold fill the house talking shh, shh. uh think twice haters don't prosper that is huda for you that happened on monday night so what do you think hey father this is too much you cannot even tell who is right and who is on the wrong one person is doing business and the other person tested the product, didn't like the product, and add their experience with the product. Who am I to say anything else with my... Okay. I won't say nothing. But guys, honestly, what do you think? Do you think what um, Murugi Munye did was fair? Labda ange muin box. I'm on be a box yeah, okay, like um you know you claim your product does this and this and that but maybe it'll affect heavy na heavy and I uh, oh okay and I didn't like it. Ama she did the right thing by just saying it out loud. Like out loud manisha for social media and other people got to read it. Okay and is that how Huda was supposed to respond? I, I know understand business. Hey, Pia Mimi Bali with Nakuta Toa Unga like that is my bees, that is my hustle. So you gotta respect it regardless. So but okay, so do you think it's okay like she did the right thing by insulting Morogi? Jubari aita sa idea and then ukisha unajua sisi watu wenye tuna consume this product to shaskia from one person mwenye amesema it's a red flag for her so maybe wengine wengine walikuwa wanangoja wasikie mtu ameyongelelea ama wamejua side effect ndio waone am i going to use this product or not you know there are people like that people who don't uh rush they wait or only like ah what's the outcome of this kama kila mtu ataipatia five stars then they may try the product moso pia mimi mimi face products i just don't go for any product i guy sometimes i buy uh, a bad product but okay i won't say bad per se but product yenye ata si ya face yangu just because it has been recommended by many people and then in a end up kukua it does not um maybe align with my skin tone maybe it is not for my skin i have a is it normal 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 amani oi i have i have a normal skin yes a normal skin eh so i might use a product again ya oily skin amani ya dry skin but no, no. because nime nimeambiwa na mabishte zangu alafu unajua tu kama sisi we don't go to the dermatologist our friends are our dermatologists you know yeah so what do you think about that like hey, wadao it's bad na mimi sijui 
usijui mimi sina mauni zaidi ya hayo yenye nimesema because actually i cannot say like yo you right yo you wrong i can't but munafikiria ni what are your thoughts guys i would love to know now let's go to the story that i have avoided for a long time story ya bahati bahati kevin kevin bahati kioko mtoto wa mama you all know him as that the husband to Jana Marwa the guy who is vying for Madare a uh, member of parliament under chama ya Nitwazi ya Jubilee so there is this guy Edwin Sifuna wamekuwa wakirushiana maneno Uh, because Sifuna said that uh, the guy had um, stepped down akachia jama wa ODM because uh, si, uh, nini this guy Sifuna is from ODM so yeah okay uh, i don't want to read the whole thing but um they exchanged words and um It was bad because after saying that Bahati has stepped down is not vying anymore and Bahati akakam clean akasema yo guys I'm still vying I nitakuwa kwa debe tarehe 9 August 2022 This guy ali sema nini This some place I am looking for Pali Sifuna ali sema he's going to take an apology from Diana that is where the conflict uh began like ile zile um what do i say yo exchange of words ili toka hapo after sifuna said that he's going to get an apology letter from not an apology letter but an apology from diana um fuck you mr sifuna keep keep your mouth away from mentioning my wife in your cheap politics um have some respect for women that is what bahati said and so because it seems this um okay the politics the politics and politics is a lot of things is a lot of things yeah and here yeah, not going to read it but they, there has been that conflict between Sifuna and Bahati na waka try to drag Diana kwa the whole thing like Sifuna did not Bahati but the uh, nani Sifuna did and wasn't good like mama ako nyumbani mama analea watoto mama anafanya shughuli zake ana create content huko why do you have to involve her kwa business za bonake like why can't you leave the woman alone abi but the most people get okay watu wengi upenda kuingililia Bahati through the other which i think is not fair can you leave them alone like kama ni bahati amekukosea deal with the guy don't drag bahati kama ni as in don't drag diana sorry don't drag diana kama ni diana amekusa don't drag bahati deal with diana and that is how it's supposed to be if i kosea you today deal with me don't drag my family my mom my dad my boyfriend into this this is my mess deal with me Okay if you are having an argument let's make it fair mimi is the letter brother cuz the letter watu wakwenu but who am i it is politics and what do i know about politics nothing 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 anyways let's get to politics and i said i know nothing about politics <laughs> this is interesting so Mlisikia manifesto ya Wazakoya. Did you? Wa well, if you haven't tunatingiza miti. That is what we are doing. Tunatingiza miti. I'm silly. I know. And he said that um, he said a lot of things, but what? There's something that 
really caught my eye. The part where he said that he's going to suspend the constitution. What? <laughs> and what will Kenya be? Umelegalize banki. Alright? Um, tunauza ninyoka ama ni testicles za hyena. By the way, who told that guy that? Like, okay, it is equal so expensive in China. Are they? Jupia China inge, like, iyo busy inge kwe shadu di kana kitambo. And then, we are trying to protect our wildlife. Sasa without hyena, so we'll be laughing in the forest. Anyways, uh, what else are we doing in that, um, hmm, manifesto? We are also going to shut down the SGR, my friend. To look at my, okay, some of us cannot afford an air ticket to Mombasa. That is around 45, 55, uh, one way. Na hapo, ujaenda, sijalipia Uber from here to the airport. Okay? Na sijachukua Uber tena, he can itoa the airport to where I am going. Maybe naenda tabiani, my friend. Okay, there is an airport that to send me naenda some place like, um, within the town too. So there is a car distance. Alafu najua, Eh, moso if you're not taking Uber, I'm talking about taxi. Taxis are up, they'll be a little bit expensive. Ata zile magari zinaenda hapo ni expect us. He? Mitao. So, SGR, it's a little bit um fair. Sababu unajua, mimi nitafika tu pale. Ata kama nitachajua, like, pia with these, uh, in a kukost kuenda uh, kwa hiyo kituo cha SGR and is of pick-up stations. There's a, a little fair to pay. But, hey man, Imagine tena turudi kukalia inaitwa aze basi all the way to coast na tulikuwa tumezoea some shortcut si shortcut but that's some shorter means eh? inakupeleka haraka kidogo hmm waja kwa hapo umetufinya sisi wa Kenya umetufinya mi kai sisi mi mize ne vivu umenifinya we nisikuje kuanza kurushiwa mawe huko i love my life so we've done all that there's something else that you're doing Okay, there were several things, but mimi hiyo ya kususpend constitution. Hey, see, we will be animals. Tukwa kama wanyama. Hmm? No, you cannot hide. Like, unajua, I, uh, sometimes we should appreciate the way things are running in our government. Unajua, weed is illegal, but we still do it. So, who is smoke mbele ya mzae, man? Unakaficha. Huh? Unakaficha. Uwezi stone mbele ya makara unajua saizi na manisha if it's legalized unenza enda ukiwashe and then uki, uki pass tu kwa karao wapo. Wata mausi yesu mambi haya. Tume pass. Tume pass na tuka pass. See? Yeah, so what do you think about that manifesto? Because I know it has, um, should I say, excited many Kenyans. Like, wah, watu wako hapo, wanachangia. They like it, but get to think of it like catching you fikiri vizuri because tuko na madeni ya tukatai pia mimi na daiwa na mwingine pia na mdai and that is it the country um in a daiwa na pia i think tunadai mtu kweli as a country <laughs> okay it's not a laughing matter but it may sound too funny yeah so yeah we need to pay the debt tunaelewa but i don't think bang your snake and your hyena's testicles is going to cut it no at if you are going to work for four days four days how much is unga? like it how much will be unga? because right now it's at 200 to 250. imagine tunafanya kazi for four days wadao constitution suspended Nobody will tell you nothing because we know a, a country, I think, is uh, governed by a set of rules. And without those rules, we just but animals. Mahaya, stakua, hayawani. Because nobody can tell you shit. There's no... Will we also... We are going to hang the, the corrupt people. Why do we have to hang them? Tusituweke tu jela wakai uko. Rather than hanging people like what? Ita kuwa ni a little bit of dictatorship. See, hii ni mauni yangu. Ni mauni yangu. Wadao, I would love to hear yours but don't crucify me with my own. 
yeah so what else has trended this week by the way uh ha what else what else hmm i think i've covered the interesting motion oh before i close before i end this video hmm, i forgot r kelly is going not is going has been sentenced for 30 years in prison for rape Ukiona Arcadia na imprisoniwa and I kind of I kind of you know you don't trust something fully but I kind of trust the um government ya majuu the American government I kind of trust it sikumaanisha and then see kitu imeanzishwa leo like it is it's something that has been there there has been allegations na kind of hivi na hivi you know that procedure yeah but ikikuja kufikia kwa hali that is being sent to jail hmm. i think i don't think okay yes i think there must have been had evidence he's been found guilty yeah to see back watoto not to see watoto anybody yeah if somebody doesn't want to have i'm to give their consent into having sex with you don't force it yeah because what well, some of these people do not funny they have money they are celebrities they are untouchable hmm. but there is the law and who is above the law nobody nobody is above the law all right yes so So mungala vitu mob a hope zingine zimeku enlighten about one or two things that maybe you knew but you weren't sure others zimesisitiza Yeah but that has been motion yenye imekuwa ime happen Oh ngojeni wa dao there is another interesting commotion akiga inakumbuka motion na nataka ku wrap up this video guy mimi Kenneth yeah my guy your guy um uh, alituma 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 what okay he posted a photo akikuwa ameva address uh is it bubbly okay something that looks like ivy when i get sketchyish and akasema it was in, inspired by Dana Marua, I think your dress Dana Marua will come eva. Dana Marua and Mili Mili Cheli. Uh, they had worn those dresses kwa even fulani ilikuwa the, yeah, the Kate Kate the act, actress uh, she was launching her lip product. By them nichangia ni mimi hiyo product na itaka. Nimechanga changa na pesa haitoshi. Unaweza nisaidia. <laughs> That is the navy for you. Yeah, so can you just say that your outfit is quite inspired by those two ladies? And yeah, she's she he Skinovia is male. No, he's okay, Skinovia. He stepped out in his dress. Yeah, and it, I think Kulikwana Yo event, it was all pinkish like you. Lazima uluku kuwe na something pinkish for you to be served. Okay, I didn't follow up si kujua hiyo event ilikuwa ya nini but I remember it was I I know I saw it was a pinky affair. Yeah, so I think now I'm done. Still ongeza mambo mengine. I'm so done. So ongeza mambo mengine. So that has been me, you girl G. At least umekuwa na highlights the he wiki now when you want shule students uh and peoples do you in yeah, youtube i'm an munangalia cartoon na munasoma yeah yes so that has that is what has been happening throughout the week but now let's stay um united as a country <laughs> let's maintain peace during uh the campaign uh period guy 
wa na is a blab guy na is a blab anyways wadao i am so happy that you get to watch this video feel appreciated feel loved by g the dopest storyteller and stay tuned for more and more and more videos bye i'm gonna say my audios what does that mean audios ciao okay <laughs>